tomorrow I'm going to be starting a 28 day challenge. A 28 day challenge is specifically to try and get some strength in, some strength and conditioning in before a fight were to happen. So that way I'm going into the match with some strength versus no SNC at all. Am I actually going to do a match at the end of the month? No, I'm not really going to do it. But the reason I'm doing this, the reason why I'm interested in doing this is because as I'm transitioning a little bit more into fatherhood outside of Taekwondo, I wanted to continuously still give you guys information, those of you who are watching from the Taekwondo side of things. And initially, I was going to give you guys my weight cutting strategy. However, there are two issues with that. Number one was I realized a lot of you asking me questions are not above 18. And I do not recommend cutting weight if you're below 18 because I don't see you sacrificing height for forever for a couple matches in one year. That doesn't make any sense to me. So I don't recommend cutting weight if you're below 18. If you're above 18, you're a grown adult, you make your own choices. The second thing, however, was it's, I understand that when I cut weight, that was in 2008, there's new research, there's new technology that's come out since then. And so I was hesitant to put it out because I, I was thinking maybe I should do more research. And luckily I found a guy who is very much into the strength and conditioning world. I said, hey, you're up to date on all of these things. Here's what I was gonna release, what do you think? And he read it over and he said, well, you know, Chris, I gotta be really honest with you. A lot of this stuff is a little bit outdated and if you wanna still put it out, you know you can, but I just, uh, there's some stuff in here I think we should fix. And I thought about it and I said, you know what? I'm not gonna put it out because I don't wanna give you guys bad info. So the point of me doing this 28 day challenge is because some of you guys message me like two days before your tournament. And you're like, Chris, what can I do to be better? Like in two days, man, rest. That's about it. Like, there's not much you can do in two to five days before a tournament. You can relax and tone it down a little bit before you go into maybe somehow get a peak in there. But unless your training has been kind of cyclical the way it's supposed to be, not much is going to happen. So. Some of you guys though hit me up and you have one month before your tournament. One month before your tournament, I would say you can hone about half a weapon. If your weapon's almost fully developed and you need to tune a little bit more of it, you got, you got a month, yeah, you could probably fi finish fine tuning it in that month. However, for strength and conditioning, if you ask the old Chris, old Chris would have said, man, tough. Um, fight this, just do your training as it is now will handle or handle the SNC after this tournament's over, find a strength and conditioning coach to handle that for you, and then work on your strength from there. However, I brought the idea to this guy. I was like, I have some people who are asking me about a strength and conditioning program for one month. And the goal of the one month is just to be, you know, a little bit stronger and not affect the game too much, or just a little bit stronger than they would be a month ago. And he's like, you know what? We actually have a 28-day challenge built specifically for something like that. I was like, what do you mean? He's like, I have built the 28 day challenge and essentially what it is, is it takes someone who has not lifted before and at the end of 28 days, it helps train their discipline. It helps their um, strength and conditioning because it shows the proper way to do repetitions, shows the proper cadences for the repetitions and shows good full body compound exercises to do that help the overall athlete. And I was like, well, that sounds pretty good. Let me try it out. So what I'm going to be doing this over this 28 days is what I'm going to be going through the challenge myself. But number two, I'm going to be going through the challenge and any part I find issue with, I'm going to be talking with a coach, discussing what can be improved and then adding back that back into the program. I'll keep you guys updated on my IG stories on how things are going, but I'm pretty excited to see where this goes because I definitely want to still be able to give back to you guys who are still in the game, who are still trying to, um, still trying to win and get out there and provide you guys a good system to start your start learning your strength training off. So this is my video for today. That's just my announcement. I'll see you guys tomorrow.